What's good, y'all? Lily Reds here. Today's soap review features Barrister and Man's Behold the What's Us. And now he is Reds. Barrister and Man released Behold the What's Us on March 9th, 2019. Uh, this is a limited edition scent. Um, will be made until April 11th, 2019, if you're interested in uh, picking up a set. Um, this is a tribute soap and aftershave to uh, Dr. Seuss, uh, celebrating his 104th uh, birthday, if you will. Um, he's been passed away for several years now, but uh, Barrister and Man wanted to release this soap in honor of him and his work um, on children's books. $1 per soap and $2 per aftershave um, will be donated to the Children's Literacy Initiative. And uh, I urge you to support that charity if you uh, can and don't want to purchase this soap. Uh, Barrister Man can be ordered direct from their website and also found at third-party resellers such as MaggotRazors.com, WestCoastShaving.com, and for our friends in Canada, top of the chain. So Behold the Wetsis is a uh, spring-like scent which also uh, evokes memories of your childhood. The uh, scent notes listed are grapefruit, rose, dryer sheets, tangerine, and sugar. Uh, the scent to my nose opens semi-sweet from the uh, grapefruit and tangerine before a hint of the florals come into play from the rose. Um, and then you get quite a bit of sugar and a little bit of chemical sweetness from the uh, dryer sheets, if you will. Like almost all Barrister Man scents, this is not a, um, a cord that you can really grab all the individual notes, but it's rather a uh, sum of all its parts, if you will. It's quite bright and quite sweet. So if you... Uh, don't like sweetness, this may not be your thing. Um, the scent itself admittedly was um, too sweet for Mrs. Rudd's liking. Um, and it's not in my wheelhouse, but I do appreciate the uh, intent behind the scent and you know the evocation of childhood memories that it does provide based on that. Scent strength on this soap is mid-strong off the sample container I have, and it's remained mid-strong through the uh, lathering process and subsequent shaving process. Behold the Wetsis is offered in the uh, Barrister Man Excelsior Soap Base. This is a tallow-based soap. Um, as always, I'll list the ingredients below for you to take a peek at. Uh, it should be noted that while this is a soap review, the uh, aftershave in this is featured in its new Delta space and uh, is quite a nice upgrade from the uh, former Tonique aftershave base. So uh, Excelsior is a on the firmer side of mid in terms of soap firmness. Loads extremely easily into your brush fiber of choice, be it synthetic or animal hair. Um, it features a very wide hydration band. Um, while the soap is not overly thirsty like some of the former Barrister Man soap bases were, uh, it will take quite a bit of water but is not necessary to uh, really dial it in. When you do dial it in, the uh, consistency of it will resemble Elmer's glue. It's got a nice sheen to it and uh, low structure but very dense lather. You'll probably recall from previous reviews of Barristan Man that um, in the Excelsior base that this is an elite level slickness soap base. Um, both primary and residual slickness are oil on glass slick. I can easily buff um, and move the razor with no visible lather without fear of uh, the razor dragging or skipping. Uh, really nice slickness on this. One of my favorite in terms of slickness in the uh, artisan shaving soap space, if you will. Post shave is also elite. It leaves your skin extremely supple and well hydrated after the shave. Um, 
really a luxury level post shave, if you will. Stands with uh, some of the best post shaves available in the uh, wet shaving market. It's no surprise that this is my current favorite soap base. Uh, I've mentioned it quite a few times. Uh, nothing has changed since I made that proclam proclamation a few months ago. Given my extensive experience with this soap base as well as the uh, metrics just discussed, the uh, shave score for Barrister and Man's Excelsior soap base is a 98. And for uh, similar performing soap bases, I'd suggest you check out Ariane and Evans or Talbot Shaving. All right, beautiful uh, dome shave today with the Barrister and Man. Behold the what's this. Really enjoy um, the charity behind this product. Uh, as you all know, I do have a uh, young daughter who's uh, actively reading in school and enjoys reading in her spare time. Not as much as I'd like, but enough to uh, keep a dad happy, if you will. Do hope you'll have a chance to support this uh, cause for the Children's Liter Literacy Initiative. Um, by either purchasing the soap or perhaps donating directly to the cause. As always, thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it. Comment below if you have anything to say. And if you're not already a subscriber, please become one. See ya.